Hey, what's up guys? David Hoffman here from David's Bin here, coming at you from beautiful Salala, Oman. Today I'm taking you to the old souk of Salala to see the frankincense. If you guys don't know what frankincense are, it's basically sap that's extracted from a tree that's local to the area, and they use this as incense, as medicine, and they eat it. We're gonna explore the market, we're gonna buy some stuff, and from here we're gonna drive over to a beach and see a blowhole. Hey, ready? Hi, welcome. Thank you. Welcome to the old market, to the frankincense market. So that's frankincense right here, right? Yeah, there are, there are different type of frankincense here. This is the best quality of frankincense. People use it for as a, as a medicine, put in the water in the night and keep to morning to drink. It's good for stomachs, for health. In the ancient times, like Egyptian people was using it for mummification. They believe about uh, the smoke of frankincense or smell, they push evil eyes as evil, evil spirits away. That's high quality frankincense. Yeah, green crystals, green and white crystals. So, look at this. Oh wow. It's hard, like a rock. Yeah. How it looks like frankincense now. Oh wow. You get the smell from now. Yeah, yeah. It smells amazing. Yeah. I mean, it smells way better than incense. Mm -hmm. Ooh. That smells great. And can use it this is at home to refresh. To refresh the house, the house. yeah, of yes. course. It, it almost smells like a nice perfume. Yeah. Oh, I just put it all over me, man. Freshen oh, me up. Uh -huh. <laughs> Close the claw. No! <laughs> Perfect, and then what did he do here? Uh, this is incense, the sandal oats and perfumes, you know, the mix. They'll use frankincense for now, probably like that, you know, for the oils. Right here we have frankincense soap. Yeah. So it's good for the body, you know, to, to wash the body. Mm -hmm. Especially for the ladies. Frankincense oil. This is more of medicine, right? Yeah. As, as like uh, perfumes. Wow. That's amazing. And it burns so fast, no? Yeah. So how much does one of these bags cost? Half kg, around 7 reals. 7 reals? Around 20 dollars. One kilo, but this is the less quality, just for instance, to prepare about four reals. This is the low one quality of frankincense, about three reals. When you come to this market and you buy some frankincense, you can't just buy the frankincense, you have to buy some coal and you have to buy one of these preas, right? That's what you call it, prea? Yeah. So that this is where you put it into, you put the coal right there, you let it on fire, and you close it and it comes out. But, you know, if you're gonna buy, buy one of the local made ones, right? Because made out of clay, pretty nice. Nice souvenir. Oh, you have that one too? That one's nice. And what are these right here? Amber, lavender, wood, and this frankincense. But these are all to burn, right? This is not to eat? This for burning is either saffron with frankincense, amber with frankincense, lavender with frankincense. The ones in the bags are regular. These, he added some different flavors, like this one's saffron. So when you burn it, you're gonna add that saffron smell, right? A little different. <laughs> That's cool. And then he also has some other stuff here, some gifts. If you have kids, buy them a little camel right here. Obviously, Salala. Beautiful stuff. I, I like these, man. These are nice. Different colors. So all the same, right? Like this one right here. So same thing for this? Yeah, yeah. So this is frankincense oil. Like a cologne, right? Oh, wow. It's amazing. Yeah. Very nice. I guess we'll try more. Oh, wow. The first one's awesome. This oil. Very nice. So all these different flavors, yeah, different right? Flowers. Different flowers. Yeah. Oh, that was good. And this musk. This one? M musk. Musk. Musk, yeah. This is usually for, usually for woman. For woman? Here you go, buddy. Here you go. <laughs> <laughs> rose flower. Oh, that rose. I could, like lick my hand. I love rose. It's so good. Oh, yes. Two reals and one real. Of course, I'm here, so I'm going to buy. Okay, so I'm going to take this guy right here. It's beautiful. I'll take this one. And then I'll take a small bag of frankincense. So total price is 10 real, right? So best quality, half kilo. And then this one, I think it's the best one of all the clay. A little, oh, <laughs> almost dropped it. Um, yeah, I mean, just I love the flag, right? Beautiful. So total price is uh, 10 or what is it? You tell me. Okay, 10 real, 3.5 and 7. 10.5. Come on, discount, discount. Discount. Uh, discount. Okay, 49 real. 9 real? Okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Nandi, Nandi. Nandi. Here you go, sir. Thank you. Shukran. Shukriya. 
Asanji. No, it's Nandi, Nandi in oh, South Nandi. India, South India. So I've spent 11. You gave me a discount on the on the frankincense and the little clay pot, but I also bought two little camels for my daughters. Of course, I have to buy them. And he, it was two. He gave it to me one, each one for one, right? Thank you. And he also has some cool uh, little Omani, you know, souvenirs, right? These are for the refrigerator. And then he also has this right here. This is nice. Look at this. Omani dagger. Finger. The dagger. Okay. Hey. Again, Welcome. thank you. So a bunch of little shops, right? Some of them are closed right now. Obviously it's part of the time of year, not season. How are you? Everything good? Hey. No problem, no problem. So more frankincense, huh? It's the land of frankincense. What do you have there? It smells great. And that's frankincense? Yeah. So basically he just has way more frankincense here. It's the same concept. This guy has a little more stuff, right? And those Similar, those yeah. pots are a little more yeah. glamorous, right? And then over here we have frankincense oils. Hey, chokoran. Yeah, so more and more shops for frankincense. So you can see frankincense outside, big, big bags. Yeah. You have smaller bags and you have more clay everywhere. Is there anything else here? Is there any, uh, like, so, oh, this is cool. There's a nice alley here. Yeah, so what do you have there? This is here, we call it a uh, parlor or uh, language. We use it for many things, for camel milk. Okay. For milk camels. For uh, the time for the harvest, the frankincense. Oh, and beautiful. This basket for, har for the harvest. It's this, a straw basket. This is for goat's leather. Or okay. Leather, camel so, leather. Oh, it's leather in the bottom. Okay, okay, I didn't see that. Palm trees. Okay, palm trees. Yeah. Beautiful. So they sell it? Yeah. This is, can use it for the milky or some also for the, for the harvest of uh, for, uh, frankincense. They smell that leather. Wow. Nice, very nice. Handmade, yeah. Handmade, yeah, of yeah. course. They have smaller ones, they have small baskets as well. Everything very similar, right? So made with the palm tree yeah. and, and leather. It's never ending frankincense. I mean, this is like frankincense heaven here. Yeah. Look at this frankincense. Look how many there are. They're huge rocks. Huge. So I can eat this one? Yeah. Like this? Eat it. Yeah. It will be sticky, huh? Oh, man. Frankincense. Mm -hmm. Tastes like I'm eating perfume. Very gummy. Mm. It's not. I don't know. Keep going. Yeah. Mmm. Straight like perfume. It's good for stomach. It's, it's. It's like a hard gum. Oh my gosh. It's getting better. A little wild. Nice. It's okay. Not my favorite, but why not? <laughs> In the land of frankincense, you have to. Mm, okay. So here, we're getting more souvenirs, right? We have hats, we have wallets, we have daggers, and we have camels everywhere. Mm, oh yeah. Oh, it's getting better now. And here we go, guys. Look at all the hats. Wow. Amazing. Every color. So what color should I get next? Because I'm taking this off. Wow. Let's get a different color. Nice. Yeah, I'm scared. Blue. Yeah, it's good more handsome. Okay. So what do you think? I mean, it's a lot of different designs, right? Yeah. So, I don't know. They all look really cool. That purple one looks nice too. Very different. And what do they cost? Like maybe like two each, something like that? Yeah, different prices. Yeah. So you have to find your the size, right? And then yeah. we go and we find it, right? Yeah. And they also have the turban. The turban. So you can add a turban on top. Maybe? Yeah. Why not? So he's seeing what size I am, because that's my hat. 11 and a half. Okay. So black one, before I read? No, no, no. That's tiles. Oh, okay. So I guess I'm going with the style, right? I think black, uh, now for it will get a little bit warm, they will get hit. Mm hmm. You know, better do the other colors. This one's nice, though. Love this one. So this is the style, right? Mm hmm. Just like that. Like this. I don't know. I'm just doing it like my way. Too much? Hear that? <laughs> no, I'm joking, I'm joking. We'll figure this out. This is very nice though, this color. Have a design. Beautiful design. So you bring like every color here, huh? Nice blue. Looks like a black. So this is 11 and a half. You think this is the right one? No, this is too big. Oh, because you're like fixing the hat, huh? Yeah, you don't just put the hat on here. You have to style it. You have to make it cool, right? Oh, that one's nice too. Like all the designs. Let's see. Let's see. What do you think? Is that the right size? 
That's the right size, right? The design's cool. And then he made it like this, right? Like a little... Yeah? Think this is better? So of course, he told me to go with blue because it matches my eyes. <laughs> You're too funny, dude. Khaled. <laughs> of course. I mean, for this one, it's either like, I feel like with the shirt, you get like a red or a green, you know? How much for this hot? Two real. So like five bucks for the hot. Last price. Uh, David is much better. It's close to your hat. Same color. So how do I put it on? Just on the neck like this? Yeah, unfortunately it's extremely hot outside. I think it was like almost 100 degrees. So you said two for this and four for this? Yeah. Six? Six? Two for you. Low price. Last price. Five? Five last price. <laughs> six it is. Six it is. Okay, okay. Chocolate, chocolate. It's going to be easier to break a 20, right? Hey, thank you so much. Chocolate, chocolate. I appreciate it. Here's the pasma. Oh, nice. This Frankenstein. Wow. No, no, you don't have to give me. Here I give you. Gift? Give you, no problem. You were here too kind, too kind. This guy's too nice. So, how much do you usually charge for this? It's one real cost. You worry. My best. Well, I, I, don't worry, my friend. I'm going to bring for you some more clients. Okay. Chokran, chokran, chokran. This is too much. Hey, thank you. All right. Hat. What do you do with the turbans? You do what you can to to wear whatever you want. Direct. Direct, huh? It's beautiful. Okay guys, so we explored the souk, we walked around the whole thing. Right now there's currently about 10 shops open. They're all very, very similar. Some have baskets, some have clothing for women, some have headpieces. They have some really cool headpieces that have like the scarf already like sewed onto the headpiece, but that's for kids. Unfortunately, they're not for men. I was gonna buy one because it looks really, really nice. But you no, know, that's basically what it is. So this is it, right? This is the souk. So you can see, easily like more than 25 shops, but half of them are closed right now. Obviously, it's not season. I'm here in uh, March, I think, 2nd right now. March 2nd of 2022, not season. The best time to come is July, August, September. My friend, thank you so much. Bye -bye. Appreciate it. Bye-bye. Take care. Nandi, Kerala. <laughs> Woo! All right, let's go, let's go. It got so hot right now. Oh, scorching. Hey, it's only March. Trying the frankincense was intense. Chewing the frankincense? I know, no. My hand. Oh. Pure frankincense. Oh. So, so maybe we can see the trees now. Possibly, right? On the way? Inshallah, yes. Inshallah. Okay. It's a desert right now here. So they're doing a lot of construction. A few different buildings. Yeah. And... Now we go to the park. Now we are in the city center now. Now we will drive to the west of Salala. To, to visit and to see the Frankincense trees after that Moksil beach and, and the boholes. This is Salala, as you can see. It's a mix of very small buildings and then mid-rises. So mid-rises is like five, ten floors. And then over here we have a bunch of like one, two stories, three stories, a big mix, lots of commercial, a lot of honey. Yemeni honey, huh? Yeah, lots of locals from like, Yemen. Because yeah, Yemen's right here on the border, right there. How far is the drive? Around two hours. That's it? Yeah. After a 20 minute drive, we made it here to the middle of nowhere to a Baswala Sakra. Francis trees. Look out to the sub now. It's a fresh sub. Yeah. They start slowly, slowly going out. After around two weeks, they get dry and hard and they collect them. Then again, after they collect them by in the basket, the same place, this like desert, the, the trunk, again, they get more sub and better quality. Two weeks later, they collect them after like the, the third times. Because the harvest it will be from April to September, they can get trees to get rest for one month, two months. After that too, you can do it again. What's well, amazing, I can smell the fragrances right now. Yeah. It smells almost like it's burning, you know? Mm -hmm. Beautiful also, tree. You, also, if you prayer in the world, the fragrance world, Smell the fires this morning. Hello, guys. He cut this one open right when we got here. As you can see, now it's really coming out and it's thickening up really, really tough. Let me see. Oh no, super soft. 
No, it's it's not as soft as as sap usually is. It's it's still uh, harder, yeah. you know. So it hardens like in a few hours. It'll just be really hard, right? Like one of these. Uh, uh, two around two weeks get more dry. Like this one. Maybe after after maybe two three, two, two three days, which will be like this one. Okay. About two three weeks, two, two between two three weeks, get more hard and dry. As soon as you touch the sap, it smells great. Yeah. Put it in the beard, right? A little bit here. I'm joking, I'm joking, <laughs> I'm joking. Now you guys know if you want to see the Frankensons, contact Khaled and come straight here to this beautiful tree. Beach time? The beach, let's go to the beach. Oh, the sun is scorching out. Best time to come, July, August. Of course. <laughs> we have nice weather, good temperature. What is this area called? This is Almoxil area and all of the mountains here, limestones. And this is around the direction to Yemen border, around 120 kilometers from here now. So we drove easily like 30 plus minutes outside of Salala going south towards Yemen. West of Salala. West of Salala, yeah. So obviously south is the, is the sea. Yeah. So deep west. And over here, it just changes completely the landscape, right? We're going through lots of little hills. And in front of us, we have pure mountain range, right? Yeah. Huge mountains over there. So this is Moxil Beach, around 45 kilometers. From Salala, west of Salala. And also Moxil Beach, one of uh, the beautiful beach also. Mm -hmm. One famous for uh, the blowholes. Okay, awesome. Yeah. And uh, the beach, you can see the beach and mountains. Yeah, together. together. Yeah, together, it looks yes. beautiful. It actually looks like uh, if you've seen scenes of like Jurassic Park. Yeah. That looks like it. You know, the mountains. Grand Canyons. Exactly, yes. exactly. Gorgeous. I mean, super flat, uh, white sandy beach. Yes. Over here we have an area where people are hanging out. Yeah. And sometimes you can have good chance, especially in the morning, you can get sometimes uh, some dolphins there. Some dolphins right here? Yeah. So this is like a virgin beach. No one's here right now. I mean, there's a few fishermen boats over there, uh -huh. but that's it. Yeah, a few people now this they came now. And then from oh. here you go all the way to the end and that's the blowholes? Yes, around five kil six kilometers from here. Six kilometers, uh, oh wow. Coastline of the beach. Okay. And almost like uh, empty. Almost empty. Yeah. Nice. So I guess we'll just uh we'll go to the blowholes. After a quick two minute drive, we are here at the blowhole. Over here we have a cafe and up here, let's see the hole. If you've never seen a blowhole, it's an amazing sight. I've done it in uh, Curacao. It's beautiful, it's just a hole. The water hits hard and it splashes up. We call it Alvernif Cave. And the ancient time was under the seasides. Now we continue away to the place where they get the pump and the blowholes. Wow, this is like amazing. Look at the beach there. Oh, it's beautiful. Wow, stunning, stunning. The only other place I've seen a beach like this is part like Costa Rica, but full of people. This is yeah. great. This is great. Yeah. Wow, and this cafe, what do they have? Food or just uh they have food, coffee and everything's there. Everything there. So you can come here, relax by the beach, yeah. get some lunch, go to the blowhole. Yes. Okay. And take, take relax. Relax, yeah. Very very calm and quiet. Amazing. Yeah. Close your eyes, relax. And you listen to the waves. Yeah, like echoes through, huh? The waves. The waves from there. So peaceful. This is the best life in Mumbai. Man, I can like sleep right here. Can we live where you want to sleep? <laughs> yes, peace and safe life. Oh, it's a big area, huh? Yes. Not so small. Woo! Look at this. It's like a desert out there. Nice rocks. Very similar to Curacao. Very similar. And right here by the water, we have the blowholes. So this blowhole is actually covered, as you can see. You can hear it though. Let me get down here. So when the water crashes against these rocks, the water will come straight up here and spray. Hopefully it doesn't happen now. That'll be horrible. <laughs> but look, just on top of it. Let me show you this, guys. Look, just get low right here. Ooh, it's hot. You can hear it, right? So the water's right there. Just goes in. You can see a little bit of water down there splashing. All right, it's a little too hot for me right now. Let's go to the shade. The name of the cafe? Moxil. 
Moxie Cafe. Yes. So just like the name of the beach. Yes. So this all is, this, this is Moxie. This, this is the area called Moxie. Okay. And everything's Moxie, you know, the beach, the coffee, the blowhole, the booyball. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that's basically it, right? So we went to the souk, we saw the frankincense. Yes. I bought some gear, bought some frankincense, bought a bunch of souvenirs. Definitely do that when you come to Salala, right? And then after that, he'll take you to see the tree and then you can actually see the sap coming out yeah. of the tree. Incredible. Yeah. I mean, this is something that's been around for ancient, for centuries, right? Yeah. People have been, you know, collecting frankincense, selling them, yeah. you know, using for medicinal purposes. Also, now they produce for like as a perfumes, like oil, soap, creams. Wow. The Armentic. We call it, in the ancient times, we call it the white gold. The white gold, yeah. Yes. Exactly. I, I literally touched a lot of it. Yeah. My hands smelled straight like frankincense, so I went like this. Now I'm all full of frankincense. <laughs> you look younger now. <laughs> Amazing. And then after that, we came over here to the beach. You saw the blowhole. We came to the cafe. I'm having a karak chai. Karak tea. Karak tea. And that's basically it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video here in that. Salala. Oman, thank you so you much, my man. You are most welcome, and I hope to see you next time. For sure, and for also sure. your friends, you are welcome. They're welcome, you're welcome. You're yes. welcome with him, with the King Khaled. Thank you so much. He's the king. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, thumbs up, comment below. Subscribe to my channel for more awesome travel content. We'll see you in the next travel food adventure somewhere in Oman. Let's go. All the best. Mm -hmm. It's pretty good. Yeah. Special karak.